FLCO. My main man, Candy. Ooh, who's that? A Los Angeles model. So this is gonna be a video where I probably say too much and then afterwards think, why did I say all that? Oops, it's too late, I already started. Hello everyone, it's me. I just wanted to give an update on what the heck's going on in my life right now because my life is a little insane and feels like it's falling apart. If you're subscribed to the Keith or Dad channels, thank you. And if you're not, please subscribe. I'm spending a lot of time and energy and effort and hard work on those channels. And I would appreciate it if you subscribed. So if you are subscribed, you might have noticed that the channels haven't uploaded in a few weeks. That's because I've been going through the hardest time of my entire life. I'm fortunate that I haven't had to deal with a lot of bad things in my life. So I understand that I'm lucky, but right now is definitely the worst thing I've ever experienced. And I just feel that I should tell everyone uh, that I haven't abandoned my channels and I'm still gonna be putting things online. But I recently lost the most important person in my life and it was unexpected. Uh, her name's Siobhan. A lot of you have probably seen or heard her in videos and uh, she was the love of my life. And we were in very, very close. We weren't together, but we were together at one point. And then for the past like 10 years, we were like best friends and it, it's the worst thing that's ever happened to me. And now, because of that, uh, I just don't have the energy or the desire to grind super hard like I normally do. Uh, I'm normally filming, editing, writing, auditioning, streaming 24 seven, all the time. I've been doing it for the past 16 years plus, more than that, before there was even YouTube, I was doing it then and auditioning then. Uh, so it's about 20 years now and I think I might be experiencing a little bit of burnout as well. So on top of those two things together, it's just, I just don't have it in me, unfortunately, but I'm still here and I still have energy and I still wanna do stuff, but I just wanna do things that are easier and not more fun because I have fun making all the things I make, but I just need to do something that's less taxing I guess and like editing is not is insane I would edit every video on all the channels so and make the music and the dad series and it's just and then make the music videos and write the lyrics and record it it's a lot of work but right now I'm just like I just can't I can't bring myself to do it I try I try to sit down and try to edit but I can't anyway I'm rambling Siobhan and I had a lot of plans together that just aren't happening now because she's not here and because my life is just seems to be falling apart. So I don't know if I'm supposed to even say this or not, but I recently had a tryout with these guys, WWE. Here's my contract. I've been talking to them for months and now that it's probably not happening, I don't really care. I'm gonna tell everyone what's going on. I've been talking to them for months. The whole thing was set up. I was supposed to go down to the facility to try out for them and they, all the travel was planned. Everything was set up and now it's just, not happening and i've been working out like crazy on top of all the other work i've been doing so that's a little bit stressful for me as well uh, i've been killing myself preparing for this and now it's just not happening which is a bummer because i genuinely feel that i would bring something that they don't have and that i don't think they've ever had and that's uh, <laughs> a different <laughs> experience and talent with acting uh and a better maybe a better comedic performance than they've had uh, other than our truth who I love is hilarious, but I just feel like I had something to offer and I'm a stunt man and a gymnast and a physical comedian So I know I could freaking hang in the ring So and to all of you who are gonna say in the comments. I should just go to AEW I will say no because WWE hires athletes and then trains them in the ring and I've had some training from Rikishi But I can't quite dedicate my life right now to doing just wrestling training because of my acting career I can't do everything I just don't, I'm choosing not to because it's a lot. But if WDB was to hire me and pay me to be trained to be a wrestler, I'd just let go of everything else and I would dedicate my life to that. That's why I'm choosing WWE and I have like a hundred friends who work for WWE and it would be great to be in there with them. The last thing Siobhan and I were talking about was this tryout and her last interview with WWE because she was interviewing with them to be a writer and she ultimately wanted to be a backstage reporter but uh, that didn't end up happening and now this isn't happening with me. 
and I'm just kind of like having, I have all this energy still and I still have remaining youth uh, and I just want to use my physicality and burn off my energy and do something physical and fun for me and I really like boxing. So, I think what I'm going to do for the next year is document myself exercising, training, and preparing for a boxing match with someone. I don't know who. Someone out there wanna box me? Any actors, influencers, YouTubers, musicians, anyone out there, if you want to box, the 40 year old OG YouTuber from 2005. I'm still here, I'm not going away, I can't be stopped. But if you wanna try to stop me, come on. I am welcoming it. I want to box someone. I don't know if that, I know there was like YouTube boxing a couple years ago and that's where like the Paul brothers started doing it. If that's still a thing and anyone wants to challenge me and fight me, I'm 40 years old. You're probably all 22. You probably got a lot of energy. I dare you, I dare anyone to try and box me. I am not a professional. I've only had six months of boxing training and then I just punch the bag sometimes. And to all the dad and Keith fans, don't worry. The channels aren't going away. The videos are still coming. I'm just not gonna be uploading relentlessly like I have been. I have a lot of stuff here that I'm editing currently that will be put up. So please keep watching. But for this channel, I'm just gonna focus it, I think, on this new series of me boxing and preparing for a fight with I don't know who. <laughs> Maybe that will be part of the series. We'll find out who the heck might wanna box me. Maybe someone will respond to me, call me out. I could call someone out. I don't know. I just, I just wanna do it. I think it'll be fun. Come on, I dare someone. I'm literally a 40 year old who's been on YouTube since 2005. Try to take me down. Please subscribe to the Keith channel. Please subscribe to the dad channel and keep watching this channel. Also, don't forget this August, this guy needs you. America's Got Talent, Keith Apicary needs your votes. Please everyone, please vote for Keith Apicary in August on America's Got Talent. I need something to happen in my career. Please.